Hey buddy, it's John of Planet Tech, and today we're gonna get um, into a little tutorial. It's not fully finished yet, but I wanted to put up a little update video uh, covering this and one other thing. So um, a while back, I did a flash track or a sci-fi little open world space game. I am getting back into that. I, um, I just didn't have the right sprites or the time to make the sprites. Um, and there were a couple of people who were making them and it just wasn't all coming together and now it's actually coming together I have um, actually one of, the, one of my subscribers and a really actually a really awesome guy is actually helping me putting t put together some uh, professional looking sprites for the tutorial so that we can have like you know some species buy some stuff sell some stuff like an actual like flash track like set up um, where you can go around trade some really 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 cool stuff something that I've always wanted to do once I played flash track and other Star Trek uh, or other type of sci-fi type games so expect those tutorials uh, to happen um, they will be for like PC web and I would like to make a version for Android so that's maybe touch or ones for like you know when like button controls like Game Boy style or whatever um, or if you've messed around with any sort of Android consoles like a PSP clone or the GPD XD which is something really really freaking awesome um, or something for a gamepad actually that'd be really really cool Okay, so expect those tutorials to happen uh, soon-ish. There is we we're still trying to put like an entire tutorial line together, and then he has uh, he's doing it because he actually wants to make a like some sort of like game or something like that. Um, I'm doing it because large amounts of awesome tutorials I think everybody should know about. But enough about that. This uh, this is actually what I was calling a puzzle horror game, but um, I just decided just to call it a master platformer tutorial. And I'm almost about to release this. Um, some of you know uh, this is kind of like the bonus room where we have some, a whole bunch of other stuff. But we have our level one, which some of you have seen. So we have our anti gravity pixels or um, effect. And then we have a door which you're supposed to put a weight on a special like little you basically drag a block onto a weight it weighs it down and the door moves you then go to a portal and then <sighs> sorry guys kind of tired it's late um, you get moved to the portal room where you collect a magic card, so a magic card sprite, which allows you to change your character. Um, so basically, you can change. Um, I think it's like Ben 10, where he's able to, uh, or Max Steel, where he's able to change not really himself, but his suit. And that's what I'm getting at, where you can change your suit, or you could actually change your character, bring one out, bring one in. So I'm trying to build something like that. I have a basic setup. I'm going to actually expand it uh, for an Android case, where you can actually have some really good or really cool little, um, like a, a little circle. Um, with like little chunks cut out of it and when you highlight, highlight uh, one character it enlarges the image um, I'll sh show you when I uh, flesh out that idea but right now I have a sprite right here and Uh, right over here is where all the cards are going to be so you're going to click so many of these guys and then it's going to show the his um, icon right there or some information about him so that's what it's going to be and we can run a little quick demo so you're in the room it's not fully f uh, y you can't collect the card yet um, I just wanted to make sure I could get out this part so you click I for like info or whatever uh, we have the little menu. It's not 100%. I just got working. You click that, and uh, it's supposed to pin 
on left click on this we're going to pin this to this but I also need to add one bug we're going to set the position set position to another okay so we're gonna set this and now this is not how you technically do it I would have to integrate his sprites um, so we do that hit I click that boom and then there you go and as soon as you do that this menu would go down uh, this is not how you do it guys this is just me showing you a quick dirty example of what I want to do and then you would have a couple of these boxes and then as you mouse over one of them it will show you information so that's uh, what I'm going to be doing for this little tutorial box and then I want to do like bonuses like uh, like a personal shield health pickups blah 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 all that all the good stuff so it's gonna be a decently filled tutorial and then I'm gonna have one last one with like enemy AI so this one just deals with uh, environments and trick boxes and some magic stuff and gravity and character the next tutorial is literally going to be dealing with enemy AI and how to, how to get them to go from like dumb to really really kind of smart um, and a non like oh my goodness this is a lot of code type of way. So hopefully you guys you enjoy this. I'll have this out maybe Tuesday or Thursday ish. I have a couple papers to write and I have some quizzes to do and some tests coming up. So it's a busy semester for me. Uh, I'm in college and I am finishing up my batch, uh, my bachelor's. So hold on guys, I'm trying to get these out without flunking college. So yeah, trying to get my 4.0. So uh, I'll see you in the next video guys. Like if you uh, like this video, if you want to see more or want a more specific uh, uh, want a feature before I actually finish this and publish this video, if you want one, and the next video where we deal with enemies, post it down below and I will see if I can add it, it to uh, the tutorial file so you guys can see what it is. Or if you want one specifically for your issue, just post it down below or email, email me. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.